Hi, this is Melissa Heavener and this is another episode of Psychic in Your Pocket. Today I just wanted to send a message out to everyone and tell you how much I love you and I know the energy has been really powerful lately. A lot of people have been going through struggles and feeling down and kind of discouraged. I just wanted to give an inspirational message and tell you guys how much I love you and appreciate that you watch my videos and support me. But I also want you to know how much you're truly supported spiritually. You each have a guide, a spirit guide, that was assigned to you before you incarnated in this lifetime. And that guide is just loving you and supporting you every step of the way, even if you can't feel them or know that they're around. I promise you that they're there. And they are your biggest cheerleaders and they're God's little servants and they're there to make sure that you make it through everything. And so just know that you have a guide, acknowledge them in your mind and thank them for being there and you'll start to notice them around or feel more supported by the higher power or by them directly. Sometimes they'll give you messages through double numbers. Sometimes they'll give you messages through um, rocks that are in the shape of hearts. Sometimes they'll give you messages through quick little thoughts that come into your head or when you're trying to figure something out and the answer just kind of comes to you. It's definitely your guide. You know that it's them because they'll only give you encouraging, uplifting, helpful information. And depending on you know, what your purpose is in this lifetime, it sort of determines who your guide is, but we all have one. And like I said, the more you acknowledge them, the more you will feel them in your everyday life, just helping you and supporting you and loving you on your journey. And what you want to do to try to connect with them for the first time or to feel more of a connection with them, get a nice piece of amethyst, which is the purple stone. It can be any size. Hold it in the palm of your hand and also get a clear quartz crystal, which is just that it's clear, and hold that in your other palm, which helps you get into a med meditative state. And you don't have to do this for a long period of time. You only have to do it for maybe a minute to two minutes and um, you can basically just ask for your guide to come around and your guide will come around you to help you and try to connect with them in the same place every day if you can consistently because then your guide will know that that's what you're trying to do and will know that it's time that you've put aside for them and again it only has to be a couple of minutes until you get comfortable with it and before you know it you'll be connecting with them for longer periods of time but just ask them to come forward tell them what's on your heart what you're you know working on or what the day is planned and just really connect with them also of course prayer helps you feel connected prayers are always heard sometimes we don't get the results that we're looking for but there's always a greater reason for that and whenever we're feeling you know lost or down that's when you need to try to connect even more and sometimes it's easier to try to feel that connection with with the guide so definitely give that a try and just know that your guide is there to help you and guide you and strengthen your connection with the higher power with God so I just wanted to tell you guys to keep going and remember it only takes one molecule of energy to change everything to everything you've ever dreamed of. So no matter how difficult things are, no matter how discouraged you get, just, just know that it takes such a tiny speck of energy just to change everything completely and that Things can change from literally one moment to the next. So don't lose hope. Always hold on and change can be right around the corner. And you were all put here on earth for such a great purpose. Sometimes I know, you know, life happens and we lose sight of that. But God and the higher power just wants 
the most amazing things to happen for you. And usually those things that God has planned are much bigger or much more amazing than anything we could plan for ourselves. And that's true for everyone, no matter what you've been through. I know a lot of people have had a difficult past and things have happened that you regret, but just be glad that those are in the past and treat each day like a fresh start. Do one thing that makes you feel like you're going in the direction that you want to go in, whether it be connect with your guide or write down what you'd like some of your goals to be. Just a small period of time that's just for you and for your spiritual connection, and it will make a huge, huge difference in your life. And also, no matter how you're feeling, know that there's one girl out here that's called the psychic in your pocket that loves you tremendously. And every day I do my makeup looks and my videos and my question and answers, all of that's for you guys so that you can feel more connected and know that you're loved and to inspire everyone. So just know that that's absolutely true. And today's makeup look that I did for you guys was done with one of my favorite palettes. I used the Kat Von D Tattoos Chronicle palette, which is here. It's what I call my Mac Daddy palette. So I used only this palette today because you can actually use some colors for blending and for your main colors as well. So for, let's see how we can do this. For my main eye color, I used this gold color right here, oops, right here. For the outer crease, I used this sparkly black color right here. For the inner crease, I used this pink color right here. And for blending, I used this awesome kind of yellowish white color called Peanut. It was really great for, for blending. And that's what I used on my eyes. And then on my lips, I also used a Kat Von D color called Adore, and it's here. And um, I love it. It's a very red, red color, but the eyes were, again, muted color, so I wanted something to really make the lips pop. So I'll swatch it for you. It's almost like blood red, but it's an awesome, awesome color. And I did still close-up pictures to show you guys that. This is a great color for the root chakra because this is actually the color of the root chakra. So if you're having trouble with finances or family, this would be a great color to wear to give the root chakra strength. The root chakra is the first energy point on the body and it's below the waist and down through the feet. It helps you stay focused and grounded so it's always a great energy point to strengthen if you're feeling spacey or disconnected and again this or any red color is great for the root chakra because the root chakra is red but also neutrals and browns are great for the root chakra and this is a close-up look of my eyeshadow and again the kind of Golden brown was on the main eyelid, and on the outer crease was the a little bit of the darker, sort of glittery black color. Inner crease was that pretty, like, pale pink color, and then I used my favorite mascara, which is the Falsies Big Lash Mascara by Maybelline that I've been raving about recently because I've been using it like crazy. And last but not least, I used the glitter mascara by e.l.f. that I've also been using a lot. It just gives a little bit of pop and glam to your eye look and I've been doing neutral shadow color so I like to just add a little bit of glitter and glam on there. And then the lip color is the 
pop with the dark red as I mentioned but that was my look for today and it's great for the root chakra also the gold brownish color for the eyelid is really good for the crown chakra and connecting spiritually the crown chakra is of course on the head it's the seventh point on the energy body your energy body and it's the closest to heaven so it helps with your spiritual connection and also the glitter mascara any kind of glitter is great for the crown chakra so that's another reason why i'm a big fan but i just wanted you to you guys to know how much i love you and that everything i do is for you guys and for my work so just know that you're super duper loved and until next time love light and blessings bye